Hello there everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm going to talk about every Marvel superhero after Phase 4. Of course, Phase 4 is a part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe and the last known project is going to be the Fantastic Four. And of course, after that there will be a new phase where we'll be introduced to new characters. But today I'm going to talk about every superhero that we know of that will appear after Phase 4. So yeah, alright, I um, broke this video down in a few parts. So one part will be the cosmic side, we have characters that will travel the galaxy, one part will be the earth side, where the characters actually fight on earth, one part will be the time part, the characters are focused on time travel or time stuff. There will also be a magic part as well, where the characters are based on magical powers, and one part will be the universe or multiverse part. These are characters that aren't really in the MCU yet, but will be at some points, because they're in other movies or shows. There are a few side rules to this, I won't be including dead characters like Iron Man or Black Widow because they died in the MCU and they will probably never return. I also won't be able to talk about leaked characters like for example Nova because we don't really know when Nova is going to appear in an MCU. So alright, let's talk about the heroes that will exist after Phase 4 on Earth. So alright, let's begin with Spider-Man, of course. Spider-Man, of course, is the main superhero of Marvel. He will be appearing in Spider-Man 4 and probably also some other Avenger crossover movies. Fury is next and she will probably be playing Black Panther and Black Panther. Next character is going to be Shang-Chi. He's, of course, the master of martial arts and they're going to make a Shang-Chi 2 movie too. The next one is Sam Wilson, Captain America. He will be getting his own movie and of course he's going to be the leader of the Avengers. The next one is Bucky Barnes. He's going to be rumored to be appearing in the Thunderbolts movie which is pretty cool but he is still a hero so I'm going to count him as a hero. The next one is She-Hulk. She will be appearing of course in her own show but she will also be one of the great team leaders of the new Avengers. Iron Heart is also next, she will be uh, replacing, I guess, Iron Man, but yeah, okay, yeah, she looks very nice, uh, she is also a very cool character. War Machine will probably be making a few cameos, but I don't think he will be, well, a big character in the new Avenger movies, or yeah, of course he will get his own Armor Wars TV show, but yeah, we'll see. Matthew Murdock is also next, and of course this guy is going to return for sure, because he's going to play Daredevil in the MCU. Nick Fury is also here because, I mean, he'll be playing, of course, in the Secret Invasion because, I mean, he'll be playing a big part in a new show, so, I mean, he's going to accompany the Skrulls in their missions. Echo will also be having her own TV show and Allegra de Fontaine will also be the new leader of the Thunderbolts, probably. And can't forget Paul Bettany as the White Vision. These are the main Earth heroes, so, alright, let's take a look at the next part and that's going to be the cosmic side of Marvel. We have Thor. Chris Hemsworth said that Thor might be appearing after Thor 4, which is Thor Love and Thunder. That could be very cool. We have Thena, Druig and Makari. They both appeared on the ship together with Eros. And of course Pip the Troll because they're going to find the other Eternals which are Cersei, Fastos and Kingo. Captain Marvel, Miss Marvel and Spectrum will both be appearing in the Marvel's movie which is going to be cool. But yeah, I think Miss Marvel is going to stay in the MCU for quite some time because she's a very young character and she might develop some more powers in the future, who knows. To be honest, with these next characters, I'm not quite sure who will survive in their next movie because this is of course Guardians of the Galaxy. And yeah, with Guardians of the Galaxy 3 being like the third Guardians of the Galaxy movie and they said that we're going to die some people in that movie, so... Some people might die, who knows, but Star-Lord, hopefully he's going to return Rocket, Groot, Drax, Kraglin, Nebula, and Mantis. Hopefully they all will survive, but probably not, but hey, alright. If Adam Warlock, he's going to return after Phase 4 for sure. This one is Time, which is going to be about Ant-Man, of course, returning in Ant-Man and the Wasp 2. And yeah, of course, I think they will return because, I mean, Paul Rod is such a cool guy and such an epic guy. I hope they will return, man. The Wasp is here too, and the next one is going to be Loki. Can't forget him. He's, of course, I, yeah, I guess he's a hero. Let's say he's a hero because, I mean, he has done some pretty cool stuff in his own TV show. Can't forget about him. Let's talk about characters with magical powers. So we have Moon Knight, Doctor Strange, and Blade. And of course, Kit Harrington as the Black Knight. Oh, of course, too. And the last one is going to be the multiverse kind of thing, you know. And there's only one character here, and that's going to be Deadpool. Of course, we know Deadpool is going to return because Ryan Reynolds is writing the script right now. And yeah. Deadpool is going to appear in the MCU very soon. I also can't forget about the different teams that will be evolving in the MCU later down the line, like the Young Avengers, the Midnight Suns, and for example, 
also the Thunderbolts and also the Dore Malaiji. They will be getting their own Disney Plus show too. And the new Avengers will be consisting of the new, new Avengers will be like She-Hulk and War Machine of course and the new Captain America and stuff like that. And can't forget the Fantastic Four. They're going to be epic as well. Alright, but hopefully you enjoyed this video. I know I might be missing a few heroes, but I got the main characters and the main superheroes in this list. I just wanted to give this small overview of which heroes we might still have after phase 4. Of course, they're going to introduce new heroes like Nova or perhaps Wonder Man and the returning show characters like Luke Cage and Jessica Jones too. But alright, ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you later. Goodbye, everyone.